Yeah. Tacos takes requests. No, I, yeah, I didn't tell him to play Yoshi. I, I, um, I know. When he was like waffling around, I asked if he would. Uh, he, he's like, he's like, oh, I don't know. And I said Pika, and he's like, Yeah, I guess. So I, like, I kind of okay, convinced so him to go CBG. Pika. Oh, you uh, got the tech visit. I don't know if she was the or not. Maybe. Oh yeah. See. Um, oh. See, that's a, a very common habit from Yoshi is like to when they're stuck at the ledge to try and parry and then DJC aerial, right? They'll come in with the DJC, but they're at the ledge already. So all you have to do is up tilt them and then push them off. Yeah, or even uh, a lot of people will do it, but even like if you want to reset neutral, if you're in a bad situation, down smash after parry, it comes out like super fast in front of you. Right. Oh, he's not having a good time with this Kirby. Oh. There's what I love about break. Yoshi is his shield doesn't move, so it's pretty easy to shield break. Yeah. You can't shield poke him, you always get all your hits. Uh, you can't, we actually saw that you can shield poke Yoshi. Uh, if you were on the Facebook group, you'd see, um, so, on Yo they were on Yoshi's Island or whatever, Yoshi's Story or whatever. And um, they had Yoshi on the top plat and Yoshi on the bottom, and they threw eggs up at Yoshi shielding, and it poked through the shield. So you can shield poke Yoshi. It's just harder to do, I think. Cheers <laughs> last night in Dark House. Wait, V, have you ever seen that video? No. What's that? Uh, it's Stud Still's last night at Dark House. And is, uh. You know, you know, uh. The Sound of Silence, Simon Garfunkel? Hello, darkness, my old friend. Yeah. Yeah. It's a, Jason put that playing. Oh, well, it's just. Jason's just gotta show you after this. <laughs> You're saying he's better than Stud still. <laughs> wow. Stevie G just JV5 shears with Kirby. Let's see if the shears might bust out the Luigi. No, he's busting out the Pika. I go to sleep real quick. Oh, this is what I was waiting for. Here's uh, I don't. I think this is like the only match he busts out Pika for. So he busts out Pika for Kirby, and I think Yoshi because he hates the Ditto. No, I'm telling you, Shears knows his zero deaths on Kirby. Like if he gets his grab in the right place, dude, yeah. he's gonna zero death. Dude. Well, there's Pika has one zero to death. On I know, Kirby. I know, it's the same thing yeah, yeah, over yeah. and over again. Four throw, up smash, no, uh, yeah, he's, up there, up there, back there. He's not Fox, Falcon, Yoshi, or these characters that have all these different combo options. He's Pikachu, you know, you you have to be even if you're creative, you really can only do the, the you know. This is what you don't. Oh. So with Pikachu, I feel like you don't really see creativity with combos that much. You can, but what Pikachu's creativity comes from is the B. Yeah. That's that's where you see it the yeah. most. Pikachu, and I think it's down B way you can use hard hits like you were doing against uh, like I think tacos. Yeah. Like you would like go out and try to read for a hard hit down B to like take away Yoshi's armor, which yeah. is like you know really different. Yeah, I, like and usually that works a little better, but I probably wouldn't do that against a top player like that unless um, I was down three, like I was down three to one against Taco, so I went for it. But I'm just saying that's like one uh, no way that's different. Like you said, Pikachu's combos are not that many places. Fair back here. We can say that about Falcon, like, oh yeah, it's just. Go forward, up air, up air, up air, but if you get good in the game at the past level, you can do, you know, eight to, I guarantee you, ten different zero deaths for every Pika win for Pika. But you won't win, you don't really see more. Right. So you just have to. I yeah, think you have like, to improvise in other ways. I feel like if we can get a fox in a Pikachu's body, 
like more super good Falcon in Pikachu's body than just like main Pika. Like I think you can see crazier things, but uh, with Pika the main two mains and just I mean like, like... Said, rely on that edge, rely on the reading and not necessarily combos because combos are so easy. No, They're I mean so easy to do, but, you, but reads are hard, so that's what you have to do with Pikachu. You have right. to be, you have to read every single character's uh, jump and recovery. You so we've seen that. we've seen Falcon mains play Pika. We've seen, I believe, Mario Gloss is a Falcon main before he was a Pika main. Uh, we've seen Janitor oh, I play love Pika. Pikachu's get up attack. It's so mean. That's like one of my favorite moves. Oh, nice DI. Yeah, it was a great DI. Um, but you see Look, people he's like. getting off that DI. Almost a zero to death for a DI. Like that was insane. Literally just caught the match up. He was in the most great position, about to be down a stock. And he played his Pikachu with your percent and he brought it back with that DI I oh. don't agree with that as back here just to grab the legend refresh and already down, down two tilt. Jumps. Yeah, this time no DI no DI for Stevie G. Too far away. But he did get a lot of mileage out of that. Jason. Quarters? Oh yeah. I guess I can update that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Sears looking a lot better in this one. Oh, but he hits him back on stage. There was really, I don't think there was a reason to do that. Uh, yeah, he didn't try to. He tried to hit him off. I sent me that post that you posted in my quote. Yeah, get wrecked. <laughs> I don't even remember saying that. <laughs> yeah, it was during my match with tacos. I was like, really me? All my creativity goes into my upbees. <laughs> I honestly don't grab that much um, anymore. A lot more aerials. Hop areas. Oh, see, Shears had a jab grab there. Instead, he up tilted. I don't know if that was intentional. And it's not. It's not you that grabs a lot. It's just Pikachu. Pikachu is just like he's part of his neutral. I I don't think you play enough high level Tikas. Like like you know like really top. Like, well, you don't play me that much either. But like. Well, see, you don't you play two on two, bro. Like I'm saying, if you play a Fox, like you play Falcon, or you play a Cannon against a Pikachu. Well, they're that's all you to, can do. Yeah. They're gonna try to grab you. Bro. That's you're that's all hit. you can do. Or and, okay, it, and that's and so you just literally said like you don't grab and you're against against against, against the character. Grab, but against, now you're saying that all you can do is grab. Like, see well, what I'm saying? Uh, I mean, let's see. You, in the Falcon neutral, you're gonna fish a downer into a down tilt into or, a grab. Or fair, you know. Uh, fair's not that good. Like that. <laughs> If if you try and fair well, too much against for fair, but I'm saying fair can lead to a lot. You just get up smash. Uh, Falcon knows what he's doing. Um, Fox but definitely don't want to fair. All I'm saying is that peak is neutral and peak is combo game. The way peak plays to get kills, requires and uses grabs. Unlike Fox. <laughs> Mood Oh, you know, really well, Stevie G brought that back. Good God. Stevie G, the young God.